A meal at Jan last night was so good. Honestly, one of the best meals I've ever had. Today we're off to another lovely meal. We are off to Le Louis in Monaco, which is a three Michelin star restaurant. So I'm very excited. I'm a little bit nervous because yesterday was so good. I kind of think, oh, it's like, is that compare, compare, oh, so I'm so tired. The comparison, um, and when last night's was so good and it was a one, I'm like, this, one is a three so it has to be a step up and I can't imagine how it's going to be a step up but we'll see so I'm really excited the menu you just kind of choose from the a la carte which is really nice because then like the four of us are going so we can all choose like different things what we like the most I'm really excited so let's go to Monaco to Lului vegetables from the region in different texture. Today you can discover the carrots. Strawberries well, condiment. <coughs> and I suggest you to discover the fish and the vegetables in the condiment. In the selection for today you can uh, see in front of you the cut of fish, monkfish. Some a bit of mascarpone, so with a mint ice cream, and for you, some raspberry, some a bit of polenta, mm -hmm. little cake of polenta, crispy polenta, and marjolaine. us a big panettone to take away. Look at that. How cute. This was delicious. We had some um, when we, well, as part of like, they were like mini courses, but um, it was delicious. So, we need to get this home. <laughs> this is Rebecca's outfit for today. You can see that. Don't know if there's too much shadow. There's too much shadow to see. No, I think it looks all right. Okay. Very <laughs> nice. Andrew as well, got yeah. his nice hat there, look. Very nice outfit, shoes, got Tina there. Very nice. Aaron. <laughs> and we got Aaron there, look, very nice. Dapper. Look. Very dapper. Yeah. Hello everyone, so we're back from Le Louis. We actually got back from Monaco a couple of hours ago, but we've just been sorting things out because today's our last day, so we are gonna end the vlog here. Um, I think I, I don't know, I'm sad. Gotta go home. But we've got five weeks till we go on our honeymoon and we go on our cruise, so wonder of the sea. So excited about that, so that's gonna be good. Um, I think I managed to film. The thing is, is because it's been so long since I vlogged, like our last holiday vlogs were before COVID in 2019. Mm. Um, so it's kind of like getting back into the vlogging. So I hope these vlogs are okay. Um, hopefully by the time we go on a cruise in five weeks, because I've already done some vlogging, I'll get back into it. But Lalui, okay. I don't know why I said we were worried it wasn't going to be better because it's even more expensive and it's a three Michelin star but no it's the best food Definitely. I've ever had in my life we've had one Michelin star we've had two Michelin star and this was three and it was much better Different than level. the two it, it's like each one is another step up mm. I didn't think anything would beat Le Manoir but the food. Well, I didn't think I didn't think there was anything that couldn't beat it, but I just thought to myself, Le Manoir is good, and that's the best 
It's not going to oh, be I, much better. That's the I best thought. that I'd eaten. At the time, I thought to myself, yeah. how good can food get? I know. Like, Isn't there it? must be a limit. Like, surely yeah. there must be a limit of how good you can cook a certain piece of food. Like, you okay. have a salad, and like you're like, this is the best salad I've ever had. And you're thinking, like, how can you get a salad that's even better than that? And then you end up finding one, you're like, what the hell? Yeah. It was beautiful in there as well, wasn't the, it? The thing is, is in the little, in uh, Le Manoir, Everything was obviously nice, amazing, but there was two standout dishes, and that was the salmon, salmon. Oh my God. and the chicken with the sweet Ooh, corn that was amazing, sauce yeah. stuff. And they were like, by all the other stuff was not good, but they were by far the two standout things. Almost everything I put in my mouth today. Yeah, with Lulu-ing. Whether it was the wine, whether it was the champagne, whether it was the little appetizers, whether yeah. it was the meal, everything I put in my mouth, I like, even stuff, I thought to myself, I would normally go, oh, I don't like that. Yeah. I was still like, that it is nice. Even though I was like, that's not really my flavour, something I wouldn't normally eat or enjoy, I still was like, that is actually quite <laughs> nice. It was crazy. And the, and the staff and the people there were really oh my nice. God, I thought it they was like... going to, sorry, I'm oh, no, sorry. Over, no, 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 carry on. No, I, was I, gonna... I can say, sometimes like these things you think, oh, they're a bit like, you know, snotty. Yeah, no, mean, they're you, not. You go into these places so and it's super like, you know, everyone's all smart and dressed and you and the, like, the building's yeah. amazing. You're thinking, oh, it's going to be a bit snooty and snotty a little bit. But it's not, everyone was absolutely lovely. Um, they were really, jokey. Really, really nice. Yeah, it wasn't. It was, jokey as yeah, well, really like Professional, but they was laid back. Yeah. And what was also nice is like, We've been in some places and it's been quite close. So the tables have been close to someone else. You know what I mean? Like it's been like oh, no, but in. Michelin stars you're not close no, to. You're not. Michelin star restaurants you're not close to people but, anyway. No, but I'm just saying in this, you're even further oh, away. Oh, like, there's like no one like, near us here, like, at all. Yeah, there must have been, how many tables do you reckon was in there? That there wasn't bit? many. Uh, what do you say, 10? I couldn't show the room Ten because maps. obviously where it is, you need to be a little bit more discreet. So I tried to get what I could. Um, but the room was absolutely beautiful. Yeah, the staff yeah. were great. Like they, 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 you, you go to stand up, and they're already there, like pulling out your chair. They like walk you to the toilet. Like they just, oh, they, they do, do didn't they? They literally do. Honestly, if you like, go to stand so up, good. they like run over to make sure the chair's pulled out before you can get up. Like you see them watching. If you actually look around for a moment once your meal's been served, you look around, you see them waiting for little cues. So they're always like doing something. Yeah, they're I, always waiting for yeah. their next thing. But they were so good. And also what was good is we all, we chose like a different main, we chose a different starter, main and dessert um, from the a la carte menu. So we could choose, we all had different things, but you don't just get a starter, main and, and a dessert. It's not a three course thing. I don't know how many courses we actually had, but you have loads. It's not three. You have the three courses you choose and then you have all these other bits in between. Yeah. And it was... It was amazing. I don't know what I liked the most. I thought it was all so good. Yeah, it was. It was. Yeah. It was so good. It was the best. best. I've I'm ever so had. glad I went. It was worth it. Like everything was just so amazing. It was. I just I just loved every single bit. Every yeah. single. As soon as I walked in, to as soon as I walked out, everything was amazing. Does he have another restaurant? It's like Alan Ducasse. Is I don't know if that's his only restaurant or if he actually has one in the UK. Um, oh, he has one in Alain Alain Ducasse at the Dorchester. He has one in London. I don't know if this is a Michelin star though, but he does have one. Oh, it does! Oh my God, he has a three Michelin star in London. Oh, God, that's oh okay, we've got to go there. But but where we went today, Le Louis, they say it's one of the best restaurants in the world, and I can see from everything from the service to the food, to the presentation, to the different cutlery they do with each dish, every single thing is thought yeah. out so wow, like amazing, yeah. and also, the detail. Yeah, like someone like me, for example, like I go to these places, but I'm not like no expert or like, you know, like I have a taste of wine and it's not like I'm like, oh, I got the scent of the smell and I know exactly what it is. Or I yeah. taste it and I'm like, I can taste all this different stuff. I, I don't know that all I know is when I eat it or taste it, it's amazing. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So that's why I appreciate it. I like don't go into these places because I'm thinking, oh, I can, you know, you know, pick up all these things and I know what they are and I know why they're amazing. Yeah. All I know, I'm a simpleton. All I know, as soon as I eat it or taste it, it just 
you know, I'm just like, wow, I don't know why or how they make this so good, but it is. And but you can, just... you can tell the difference. Like, I just yeah. don't, I just, yeah, it's the best thing I've ever been. It's just amazing, amazing experience. Super expensive, mm. I must say, but it was worth it. And to be here and to do it in Monaco as well, instead of, you know, it was just amazing. Yeah, of course. But we're going to sign off. Mm. Um, yeah, we had such a good holiday. We've been here for two weeks. Um, yeah. Uh, we're tired. So tired. Oh my god, there's a mosquito. Nearly swallowed it. Uh, we're tired. Um, oh, we've got our little pastries from Patisserie Lac. I'm going to show you after. I'm going to sign off here, but the next clip you'll see the little pastries that we're going to eat, which is the place you've done our wedding cake because they look amazing. But um, yes, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the vlogs. Um, yeah, it's just getting back into vlogging, but we go away again in five weeks, so it won't be long until we have more vlogs. Yeah. I'm on the balcony and we have a beautiful sunset and marshmallow sky. Let me show you the patisserie lac that we picked up. So I chose the cheesecake, which looks amazing. And this one over here, I can't remember what it is, but it looks divine. Now I've got this one and this one. Again, can't remember what they are, but I'm gonna enjoy. We have this beautiful view. And then you go over here and then you can see the whole promenade. So, so pretty. And this tree is amazing because it blocks out the direct sunlight. So when the sun is setting or rising, it gets blocked out by this tree, which is amazing because then we can just enjoy this out here without, you know, look at the little boat. Do you see it? Just here. Not too.